lessons. Come on, pal. I don't take to water. Can't you see I'm getting seasick here? Chris cruelly ignores Sonic's desperation. <laughs> Look at that face! Later that night, he gets narrating. <laughs> Way to overexcite yourself. I know we're supposed to be relaxing and all, but what's there to do on this ship? Tails is just being rude. Don't pay any attention to him, Chris. He was just asking. I've never seen such immature behavior. Desperate and guilty. What do you think of that? <laughs> he collapsed. I was too overwhelming. You realize this now? See ya. Hey, he isn't sick. He's a fake. He wasn't sick at all. He just ran out of running space. He will remain here. Even a great warrior needs his rest. For a moment, Tanaka thinks he's a real ninja. You're used to seeing this stuff. Why are you straining? Oh, no! Sonic was so bored, he tried to jump ship all the way to shore. But he missed 15 times. How'd they get Sonic out of the water each time? Seems impossible and tedious. Also, it's stupid. They've got to be hundreds of miles from land. Too complicated, no chess allowed. Those dimwits thought they'd seen the end of me, but I've outsmarted them. It's required of all evil geniuses to be smart as well as sneaky. Even Eggman knows it's cliche. I cannot wait to see the look on Sonic's face when he sees the powerful new Geeko Boko XL Super Ultra. Just a minute! The XL Super Ultra Eggman Extreme! Hey! You stole Geeko's idea! How does Egg Egger and Eggius grab you? Would I be worried about the X-Tornado? Did you ever think that just maybe machines can get lonely? Well, Bakun does, but even Tails knows the X-Tornado doesn't have emotion. The way you swing that little hammer of yours around, my heart beats a million times a minute. I know, you could never care for somebody like me. I guess that's just the way it has to be. Perhaps I could go on if you would only swing that hammer once more. You've apparently watched enough movies to be this good at acting. He said his little heart beat faster every time I swung my hammer. He said little hammer, not little heart. It's all right. There, there. Now, don't cry, sweetheart. Aww. I'll put that sin back now. You come down off that pole. I get the feeling we ought to stay out of this. But Amy could damage the pole. It's a whale. That's not a whale. Yeah, you both should know better. Squish panels. I was wondering how long it would take before you bozos showed up. What? I don't think they can hear you. Let's stop here so our passengers can get a good look. Thank goodness they just avoided a Titanic reenactment. Are you crazy? This is no time to look at a glacier. You picked a destination and just threw that plan away. Also, the ship's radar must be really lame if it can't detect Eggman this close. Egg for two combine! One, two... Complete. Eggman Rangers! Sonic doesn't even touch the blast. This woman ex machina. Why isn't he frightened? You didn't hear the lady over the PA? Stay in the moment and feel the ice with your feet. This convenient interruption. And again! Also, chasing after a childlike robot for revenge is immature. Ella can do anything she puts her mind to. She stole Tails' pallet license, right? Except windows. You could just get a ladder, you know. Kick down, launch up! Speaking of launching, Sonic may be smiling now, but he knows it's Ella who saved the day. So often we rush through our lives from day to day. Let's throw a moral in to make this educational. Can't you see I'm getting seasick here?